Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. Today I will show how to create a put menu card in Excel. So basically this type of menu card or catalog will be created using Photoshop or Illustrator or any other tool. But the same kind of menu card can be created in Excel. Okay, let's discuss today and I will show you how to create this kind of menu card in Excel. This is a sample file I have created recently. So it has restaurant name and its logo details and it has six segments of a food orders okay this one and a list of food items in this section with description and a few other images as well okay let's start to create the same kind of menu card now click plus button to add a new sheet this is a blank spreadsheet to start with Select the list of range cells to merge to create name. Let me add it till 73. Go to home, merge and type restaurant name. Red chili. Food menu. Okay. Yes. click color and then go to this one and you can select any one of the color from this palette okay so this one and the merge center now now restaurant names in uh, this small format so let me try, try to change it in the horizontal way yeah format cells alignment and you can change direction to 90 degree okay and home select size as a 48 or any other thing so as per your requirement just to change it and make it bold okay and i'm going to change font color now so font color white okay so this looks nice now and the next one is about uh, restaurant name and the details to add name go to in and just select and drop and select and drag and drop here okay so this looks nice okay yeah this is fine next one is about uh, contact details let me copy all these contact details from this place and paste it okay yeah fine next one is about a uh, list of a uh, food menu category so there are six i'm going to create the same kind of category now eight Select this range and go to merge cell to merge it and copy. And going to create and click this green color. I'm going to give green color for this cell okay and font size is white okay so first one is status yep. and just copy and move it here for next one yes So first set of um, food menu is ready. Now I'm going to now I'm going to give content for these items now. So I have all these food details in Notepad. So instead of just typing everything, I'm going to copy paste all these details from this Notepad to there. Yeah. 
status and then south indian this is the first set of items yes this is done and next I started from row 36. So again, I click this 36 now. I give this H yeah. or copy and paste it here. Again, copy and paste for the fourth one. And for fifth and sixth, just uh, I'm going to paste it in row number 55. Yeah copy and go to 55 paste it and paste it yes okay now let's copy and paste all this content from notepad to excel so next one is south indian food okay this is done copy this content yes paste it here and for the third one third category fine and fourth one is rice copy this content and paste it yeah next one is breads And finally, food and finally, fresh drinks. Okay, so this is a food menu card now. So let's make it more formatted way and give more color and uh, make it professional. Okay, make it bold. So for that, I'm going to select all this category and make it bold to give more clarity. Yeah. And for all these food items, just click on it to make it bold. For that, just press Control and left click on food you know, items. Press Ctrl B to make it bold. Yeah. Okay, for remaining descriptions, just select in the same way. Press Ctrl and the left button. Go to home and click red font or in the same font as well okay so just i'm going to give the same content format yeah okay now for remaining items just you can click this one and take formatting painter and drag and drop for everything or in better way just select everything by pressing uh, control and left click from mouse to change color format yeah it's done now and make it center select this entire row select this entire column and make it center fine yeah okay 
control B, yeah, control B, select and press control B, same. Okay, this is fine. Yeah, next step is to add pictures in this spreadsheet. Okay, so for that, I have already downloaded a few of the pictures in this folder. Now, going to import all these pictures into Excel to add and place it in the correct place. So, first, let's add logo. Go to insert and there is a picture format okay so just click on it it has from this device or pictures online click this device okay this is lower so i'm taking this drag and drop and make it smaller to place it in the correct place yeah okay just drag and drop and move it small Here you can rotate in smaller size. Yeah, okay, fine. Yeah, this is done. And for remaining images, I'm going to select from the same device. Go to pictures, device. Now I'm selecting all the food menu items from this list. Okay, so it's there. Move it one by one and paste it in the correct place okay so this is related to non items move it to breads okay yeah okay next one is choose it's in fresh juice category it's smaller and drag and drop in the correct place you can uh, you can resize this by clicking this button yeah go to here okay this is fine and next one is orange again this is in choose category move it here Okay, done. Next one is this one. Yeah. Fine. And then this is Jira Rice. I'm going to paste here. Okay, this is also done. And next one is sorry. So I'm going to paste in a race section. Yes. Okay, this is for South Indian food. Fine. Yeah. Next one is a biryani item. So I'm going to paste it in this section. Fine. Okay, finally, I have a chicken 65. So here, just to paste it from this section. Yeah. Okay, so this is almost done now. Okay, yeah, almost done. And finally, for this category, I'm going to add location, email ID, web address, and mobile number icons. Go to pictures again. Take it from this. I have this icons from this folder. Paste it. Oh, 
fine. fine. This is done. So this is a food menu card that has been created in Excel. Make it a 42 and bold. It looks nice. To remove grid lines, go to view and remove grid lines. It looks like white color background. Now let's start to print the same format now. Press Ctrl P. So in default, it has been selected as A4 sheet. To change correct view, select this drop down to select A3. It will fit into the correct place. Okay, now you can see a full menu card in correct format with all description and logos and some images. Thanks guys for watching this video. I will come up very soon with another content.